Hey guys, welcome back. So Apple is working on a masterpiece by including top-notch features to the iPhone 14 Pro Max. This time, we may see this smartphone to break the barriers in terms of overall performance and user experience. Also, finally, Apple will introduce a new feature for which we all were waiting for. But before that, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, make sure to subscribe to get more daily updates and give a like if you enjoy watching this video. So as we know, when it comes to CPU performance, Apple is king of all. This year, Apple's next-gen chipset, the A16 Bionic, will bring some minor changes because according to our latest information, Apple will still use the same 5nm fabrication like last year's A15, whereas the competition is upgrading to 4nm or 3nm, this new A16 will be based on TSMC's 5nm process only. But keep in mind, no matter what fabrication process Apple will use, the A16 will be still miles ahead of the other high-end processors. With this CPU for the iPhone 14 Pro devices will bring some minor improvements here and there inside the CPU and GPU alongside the latest LPDDR5X RAM which will make the memory performance at least 30% more efficient and 1.5 times faster than the last year's 13 series. Now moving on to the next update, the iPhone 14 Pro and Pro Max could deliver the best battery life ever. According to some latest news, Apple will use the high-tech displays for these smartphones by Samsung and LG. And this time we may see the second gen LTP refresh rate means the display can change the refresh rate from 1Hz to 120Hz in comparison to 10Hz to 120Hz on the 13 Pro series. Now this feature will help the smartphones to save some battery because of the efficient display panels and optimized CPU. Also the bigger size of the phone gives us a hint that this time Apple will also be increasing the battery size as well. So looks like Apple is about to break its own on record for longer battery backup on any flagship smartphone. Now the most awaited feature is also coming for these smartphones means always on display. This feature is already available on Android devices from a long time but finally the wait is over and Apple will introduce this feature with the latest iOS 16 update. But it looks like it will be exclusive for the pro models as of now. So that is it in this video guys do let me know your thoughts in the comment section what do you feel about these updates if you end up liking this information then do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel as well i'll catch you in the next one till then peace out